Last, uh, last couple of joints here. Let's see if I can get these to where you can actually see it. It looks like that. Cool. More fire. So, other things. These are fun. This is fun. So it just kind of melts in there. We'll do this one too. So while it's doing that, the periscope chat earlier, what was Chad doing? I'm coming to Canada anytime soon? It's going to be a while before I'm back in Canada. Uh, but I'd like to. I am uh, blow torching stuff. Don't tell my landlord. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you know, you know. No, I'm not coming up to Toronto anytime soon. Sorry. I'd love to. Someday. Cool. All right, so that was that. This is the part that the plumbers tell you not to do, but see how it's all like funky and nasty? Not anymore. Flux paint, yo. Again, not an accepted uh, plumbing practice, but I do it anyways. Do this. Gives it this nice, pretty color that I'm going to totally wreck when I oxidize it, so that kind of doesn't really matter. It goes like that. Bacon, bacon. Fun stuff. Yeah, too many. I don't think there are too many. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you'd be surprised, man. Social media, everybody's got an opinion. They're all going to be like, you're doing it wrong. I'm like, yeah, well, you know, it's not pressurized. So, why don't you let me worry about that? Everybody's always got an opinion. But it's fun anyways. You know, that's the best part about home improvement and do-it-yourself stuff. Uh, if it doesn't work out, it's your fault. You should fix it. <laughs> that is correct. It is now melted on, you know? Um... Technically speaking, this would hold water, but, uh, yeah, I'm not going to hook it up to anything, so it's just going to be a shelf. So, <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. I do know what I'm doing. It's cool. I used to do this for a living, although, granted, it's been many years since I picked up a blowtorch, so you guys are witnessing the first time in maybe six years since I lit something on fire. And usually, you have a shop and a vice and all this other cool stuff that makes it, like, easier to do this. This is not the ideal situation here. I'm sitting here in a, in a shower with no vice and no nothing going on but a, a torch. And yeah, so um, now we're going to flip it around and do the same thing on the other side. Thank God for gloves because this thing is hot. Uh, goes out. Yikes. Yikes. And goes back to there. Can you see it? You can kind of see it. There we go. Uh, I am not at my house. I am actually nearby, though. I have a friend of mine's house who has shower dimensions very similar to mine. Um, what do we got here? What are we doing? 
Hi. Is it gonna be heavy? No, 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 no. It's light, it's light. Maybe four or five pounds, something like that. The piping is a skeleton for a shelf I'm building. Uh, I don't have any goggles. Well, I'm just gonna have to uh, play it safe. As safe as one can, you know. Two dudes in the shower sweating pipes on 30. Yeah, well, thankfully, there's only one dude in a shower sweating pipes, so I suppose that still sounds dirty, but in a slightly different way. We're gonna heat it where you want the solder to go. Uh, no, I'm not gonna get arc burn, because I'm not arc welding. I'm using gas, not electricity, and the light ain't that bright, so. But I appreciate your concern. It's gonna be fine. Like I said, it's uh, not the ideal way to do this, but it'll totally work, I promise. See? That right there, that's it working. This is quick and dirty. This is not the uh, union accepted way of sweat and pipe, but we're going to do it anyways. So. Come on, that's heating up. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm going to be working with any tools on General Hospital, but I would. I like working with tools. Um, I gotta book another movie first for you guys to see me in one. Yeah, another thing I'd like to do, but we'll get there. I'm working on it. I am in a tight spot. It's not a very big shower, but it's okay. Make it work. That's the mantra, right? Make it work. Cool. Well, I hope you enjoyed the top of my head for the last two seconds. And that, as they say, is that. See? Get rid of that ugly color. Et voila. Done. We're going to put that wet towel back on it. Make that lovely bacon sound. Also not something you're technically supposed to do if you're uh, plumbing. But again, this is furniture, not plumbing. So the blowtorch made the copper really, really hot so that this stuff Silver solder, comes in a spool, looks like thread, will melt. It's got to be really, really, really hot for it to melt, though. You know, yesterday's G8. Push, oh, thank you for pushing pause to scope. Um, next comes sanding. Yes, well, you don't necessarily have to sand, um, but because I'm going to oxidize it, yeah, i got to rough up the outside surface. So I'll probably scope some of that, too, because, you know, why not? Um, yeah. Fun stuff. Uh, what it's essentially going to do, I'm probably going to burn the shit out of myself doing this, but I'm going to try and do it anyways. Um, well, no, I lied. No, I'm not. That would be a bad idea. Uh, sanding takes a while, it does. <sighs> Hi, Connor. What grit sandpaper? I have no idea. Sandpaper. It's actually not sandpaper, it's sand cloth. I don't know what grit that is. Uh, most of the sand cloth that I've used in my life, uh, you don't really specify the grit. You just buy it, and then when you run out, you buy some more. Um, <laughs> I got solder on the floor, so I'll end up taking care of some of that. But all in all, for my first time in seven years, not too bad. Everything's sealed up. Should be pretty solid. 
I'm okay with it. I'll allow it. So, oh my God, I'm hungry. I'm like super, super hungry. <sighs> Sorry to do this in like little tiny steps, but yeah, you know, what am I cooking? I'm not cooking anything. Uh, I'm cooking copper right now. <laughs> right now, I will be cooking food at some point in the next hour or so when all this stuff is done, when I get to a point or two where I feel like I should push pause and stop, then it's good. Uh, a shaving mirror for the shower is going to go on the shelf and then all of my like soaps and crap like that. Um, but the top part of the shelf that the mirror is going to sit on is kind of big. So I'm going to put some moss on it because I like outdoor stuff inside. And moss doesn't require a lot of light and it doesn't get a lot of light in here because it's kind of a dark corner. Um, so yeah, it'll be cool. Plus, it, it you don't even need to water it. It's in a shower. It just feeds off the steam and the splash. So works out good. Um, I have not seen Harper in a while. They just live far, and our schedules kind of don't jive. We see each other at work, so if Bug Bug comes into work, you know, um, I'm just kind of been sitting in my house these days. Uh, yeah, the video about eating Indian food was disgusting, but it was funny, so I thought it was funny. Me and my friends have kind of a sick sense of humor, so it worked out good. Got the copper piping at Home Depot. You can get all kinds of fun stuff at Home Depot. I am good. I am hungry. I'm tired. Um, bike's good. Bike's great. Got a custom tank built. Um, well, it's being built. It'll be here. I don't know. We can change or so, and I'll take her back in, and they'll put the uh, they'll put the, the tank on, and that'll be cool. Basically, we'll double my cruising radius on the bike. So, I'm gonna be doing an appearance in South Florida, uh, Marco Island, April, May, May something. I'm not entirely sure. I got the dates somewhere. So we'll see. Uh, yeah, fun stuff. Yeah, bug bug, call it bug bug. Where do I want a vacation to next? God, I don't even know. Summer's coming up. I'm gonna take the bike out to the desert pretty soon. So, bah. yeah, that'll be fun. Mike and I going hiking soon. I don't know. We have uh, opposite work schedules, so not due to any lack of desire. We just kind of can't seem to to get it together for a whole day. You know. Um, usually in the evening times or something like that but you know then we don't have any light so we do evening time stuff shoot pool and stuff like that I have no idea when I'm going to have a scene with anybody that kind of stuff is just random I get the script it's got pages on the pages are words the words are typically said to somebody and that's who I have scenes with I, I never get any lead time I just pick up the pages and I'm like oh I have scenes with Maxi. oh I have scenes with Dante so it's totally random um, yeah so, hockey fan, I suppose. I don't know. I'm not a big sports guy. I, I just am not. I'm, uh, nothing against them. I just, you know, I don't have like a team or something. I'm that guy who shows up when we go to a game, and I'm like, what color are we rooting for? Cool. Do this. Do the thing. Win. Win the points. So yeah. Um, so yeah. Happy 21st birthday. Uh, I have a hard time with the word favorite in any category. I can't just pick one. There's a bunch of stuff that I like. Um, but I was listening to Dave Matthews earlier this morning and So Damn Lucky is definitely kind of a mantra and uh, what is it, Die Trying was another one so I'm going to go see them at some point uh, late summer it's going to be rad I'm super super excited, Lakers or Clippers I don't care zero cares uh, well there's a different saying but you know I get in trouble for my pirate mouth so Wanted me to say hi, so hi from I lost it, but cool hi from from the hi to the students. <laughs> a sport video game I'd know all about? No, it wouldn't. It wouldn't because it's sports and I have zero interest in it. Um, <laughs> yeah, Marco Island. I'm gonna be there. Uh, so it's kind of South Florida. It's a it's an island, but you know, southwestern part. Uh, so yeah, on that note. Guys, I'm going to set this thing out in the hallway and get this sanding because I'm hungry and I want to get this done. Uh, so, yeah. I'm surprised I'm not playing PS4. Why? I don't even own one. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, I will. I will totally grab some food and I'm going to sand the hell out of this thing and it's going to be fun. So, again, thanks for, you know, checking out my my jerry-rigged home improvement project but when it's done i promise it'll look rad 
it's the kicker with home improvement stuff. When you catch it in the early stages, it looks kind of ugly. But I always tell everybody, just bear with me here. Bear with me. There's a, a method to my madness. So totally worked out. Me, Dick. Cool. Who is that? Uh, I lost him. Damn it. Well, if he says something again, it's cool because it'll be the last time we ever speak. So, um, yeah. Have fun, guys. Um, I will be around. And whoa. Whoa, words. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Merci. So, yeah. Dunzo. I, I always figure out, have to figure out how to, like, shut this thing off. Oh, there we go. I figured it out. So, cool. I will... Uh, read faster duh thank you that was clever you're sharp um so yeah food time i'll probably scope again at some point to show you guys what all the clunky weird crap turned into because it's going to look sick when it's done so see ya